All right, so just to kind of start off, um, obviously you went went to, went to a lot of games at Michigan State when you were kind of coming up. Yeah. How did that sort of, like, it prepare you for, for Purdue? Yeah, um, with them recruiting my brother for three or four years and then him playing there for three, uh, definitely familiar with the atmosphere for sure. So really just it feels like I have a few years of the Big Ten play under my belt with watching him and going to so many games. So really just uh, a lot of different atmospheres, a lot of different experiences that I got to I got to see. Did you feel when you tipped off this season that you were a little bit more prepared for this than your average freshman might have been for that reason? Uh, yeah, I'd say a little bit. Uh, me and my brother talk all the time. He's always giving me pointers and stuff and uh, watching film with me. So really just the amount of support he's given me has been huge for me uh, coming into my freshman year. What's it going to be like playing there? It'll be cool. Uh, I got a lot of family and friends coming. Uh, I haven't lived in Michigan for many years. So, uh, it'll be cool to be back there. Uh, Michigan State's very methodical offense. Uh, what have you been stressing, especially as a team defense? Yeah, just stopping them in transition. They like to get out and go, and then uh, their bigs run hard. So really getting our bigs and guards back, making sure we're stopping their transition points. Just does that that starts with the glass. It always starts with the glass against Michigan State, right? Yeah, we've uh, been practicing a lot on uh, rebounding, just stopping them offensive rebounding, and also us. If we don't get off the rebound, getting back quick and uh, stopping the ball. Now, historically, Michigan State goes one on one in the post. Yeah. Um, if that's the case, is it Zach, 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 Zach kind of thing? Yeah. Uh, no matter what we do, no matter who we play, we're uh, seeing how they're guarding Zach first. That's our that's our first look, and then uh, out of that, we'll see what we got to do. Whereas uh, a team like Nebraska, they sat low and almost doubled them as soon as he caught it. So. We had a game plan for that, and uh, we'll be ready to go for what they bring Monday. You guys have been pretty good playing away from home this year. Obviously, you've been pretty good everywhere, but yeah. you've been pretty good playing away from home. Is there something that's clicking with this team, too, on the road? I'll just say it's a little bit of a chip on our shoulder. We go into every away game thinking they're going to bring their best, which they will, and uh, we like to uh, we like to keep the fans quiet a little bit, um, go out there and play harder than them, and uh, just show them, show them what we are. You know, ordinarily, freshmen – shoot better in non-conference play and then when the defenses get better and the scouting gets better in Big Ten play things kind of normalize a little bit. It's been the opposite for you. Yeah. You've, you've shot better against Big Ten teams than you did against non-conference teams. Any kind of causation there you can No, I would point just to? say uh, getting more settled in yeah. uh, as the game goes on. Started off pretty good and then out in Portland played pretty well and then a little bit of a little bit of dry spell but uh, we're doing the same thing. We're getting the same shots up in practice but uh, really just taking our time a little bit not rushing things and uh, just getting settled in. You specifically though, anything you, you talk about getting settled in. Are you yeah. are you fully settled in or anything like that? Or uh, I don't know. I'd say it comes with the game, but uh, really just taking my time and not rushing things, knowing what I can do, and uh, it helps with the amount of trust my teammates, coaches have in me with, uh, to go out there and perform.